Hello friends, in the series of C programming in previous video, we discuss regarding all functions. We also discuss some programs that is functions example. Now in this video, we are going to continue the same discussion on function. Now here we are going to discuss what are the types of parameter used in function or uh, what are the function parameters. We know that what is function? Function is nothing but set of instructions or set of statement which going to execute after a calling that is nothing but inside the function we are performing some tasks. Now while we are performing some tasks or manipulating some operation we require some variable. Now this variable are passing or this variable are passed inside function that is it accepts some parameters. Now the parameters again divide into or parameters have the types. The first type is the formal parameter and actual parameter. Now let's understand one by one what is formal and actual parameter. Formal parameter let's consider this example. Now here we are performing addition of two numbers. Now, this is the definition of function. Now, what is mean by formal parameter? Formal parameter is list enclosed in parentheses. Now, in, this is the function name sum. Now, inside round bracket, I accepted two variables. That is, that is int a and int b. Now the list contain variables. These are the variable, variable A and variable B and data type of necessary values for the method. Data type is the int. So while I'm declaring, while here also I'm declaring sum or inside definition, I consider the two variable int A and int B. You can write a number of parameter inside as an argument inside this function and that is we refer as a formal parameter and it is separated if there are one or two or more than two variables we are using or passing inside the down bracket we can separate it up separated by comma now when the method or function is not accepting any input value that is this becomes the input value a and b and this, if the function is not accepting any values or any variables, then the function should have the empty set of parentheses. That is, you can write the addition or empty set because we are not passing anything. Now here, you may be passed some parameters or you may not be passed the parameter. But the formal parameter is nothing but it's a part of a definition or while you are declaring function you can accept variable that is nothing but the formal parameter that means what whatever parameter define inside definition or inside function call you can refer formal parameter now formal parameters are nothing but the variable and here we are define by function and receive some values when the function is called. Now here in this case the function is called then the, it, the compiler control goes to the function definition and these are some variable which is which we already defined into declaration part and here also we are accepting int a int b. So it receives some values when the function is called and that is nothing but the this int a and int b is nothing but the formal parameter. Now let us understand what is mean by actual parameter. Now consider the same example. Now here you can see 
sum I pass the two parameter 10 and 30. Now these values are nothing but the actual parameter that is when the function is called by value now in next video we will see there are the parameter can be called by two ways call by value and call by reference but here what is the actual parameter when I pass the actual value and replaced by a formal variable is that is nothing but the actual parameter now actual parameter are values that pass to function when it is invoked second point while formal parameter are variable defined by function now the formal parameters are only the variable these are only the variable is defined inside the function or you can declare inside a function but the values are received while a function is called that is nothing but the actual parameters what is the difference between argument and parameter now what is argument argument is nothing but or it's act like or it's also known as actual parameter and parameter that is also known as a formal parameter now argument are used while calling a function now these are actual parameter now when we call a function we can put the actual values that is nothing but argument are used while calling a function whereas parameter are used during only declaration or you can say definition now third point argument is the actual value of the variable that get passed to the function that is we are passing some values to the function that is the that's why it's become the actual values whereas parameter are also variable but it's it define or it declare inside function only that's why it's called as a formal parameter and actual and actual values are replaced by the formal parameter so this is all about the parameter types that is the formal parameter and actual parameter these are some difference between argument and parameter now in next video we will going to discuss what is called by value and called by reference thank you